Hello guys, my name is Martino, she is Leonora. We welcome you to this channel. I'm the founder of the London Saxophone School. And in, in today's video, I wanna share with you a really great tip to make your sound fuller, but not only that, also how to improve your general musicianship. And I'm talking about projection, how to project your sound. Now, I'm gonna share with you a video, which is an extract taken from my online saxophone program, in which I talk more in depth about all the saxophone fundamentals that you need to know in order to play well musically and with a great sound. You can check that out more in the description here below. The program is currently on sale at the lowest price it will ever be. So check that out if you wanna learn more. Now, the video is about five minutes long in which I talk more about projection and how to do this technique, which is super simple. The language is super simple, really easy to understand. It's broken down into steps. So try that out. If you have any questions, just let me know here below and I will answer and I will be there uh, ready to help you. Uh, at the end of the video, give it a like if you liked it and I will see you soon. Wish you a great day and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. Say bye. 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 <laughs> Now we're gonna talk about how to expand your sound. The official word that musicians like to use is how to project your sound, okay? What I see in lessons, a lot in lessons, ensembles, groups, um, is that people have, um, students, some students have a very nice sound, but very tiny sound, shy sound, like, you know, when you can actually have a nice and big sound without you actually having to change much in the way you play, it's just the way you think, okay? So we're gonna do something, a really good exercise for you to expand your sound in in less than a minute, let's say, for real, <laughs> okay? So I have a window here in front of me. Um, I'm actually gonna show you my window here, okay? So I have a window. What I want you to do is I want you to face a window and what I want you to do is I want you to pick a point, you know, pick a spot. Uh, in my case, it's across the street, okay? Just pick a point, can be a leaf, can be a tree, can be, I don't know, can be a bike uh, parked somewhere, can be a person reading a book, it doesn't matter, okay? So just something that is distant from where you are, okay? And then I want you to play a long note, focusing on whatever you've chosen, okay? And let's do that. Let me show you. Okay, so I've, I'm gonna choose um, the door of a restaurant that I have across the street, and I'm gonna blow my sound there. Check it out. What I'm doing is I'm just focusing on my door, you know, and I'm blowing to that door. That's that's what I'm doing. Okay, so just by doing this will change your perce perception. It will change your mindset. Your muscles will do more because if you're in a room, you know, tiny room, medium room, it doesn't matter. Okay, and you're playing to uh, to a musician, to a friend, to a cat, whatever, you know. Mentally, you know, the people that you're with, they're not too far from you, okay? So your mind goes like, hmm, yeah, my friend is there. I don't have to do much effort. So I'm going to play something like... Right? Mentally and physically, you're not putting too much effort because the person is there in front of you or just really close to you. But as soon as you focus on something else, you know, Bam, across the street or, you know, face the window or whatever you have, you know, bam, mentally, you're ready. You're not here anymore. You're there. Okay. So all your muscles naturally will just engage more and your sound naturally, magically, in a way, will just expand and be more consistent, be louder, be more projecting. That's, that's the word you want to boom project okay and if you think about this um this will really improve your sound will improve your consistency will improve your general playing because you won't be shy anymore but actually you will be nice and present you want to work on sound and uh, and on the details or the nuances of sound starting from a nice and loud volume dynamic 
And then from there, it'd be easier to come down into a softer dynamic. But if you start in a softer dynamic, you know, it'll be really hard for you to build something, okay? So start building your sound from a nice and loud um, sound. Think about the window, think about your, the, the spot that you've chosen. Bah! Direct your sound, project your sound. You can think of a laser beam, boom, or like a football kick by a professional footballer. Bah! You know, it doesn't break, okay? And the muscles here will engage and your sound will be much better, okay? So when you do long notes, you can do this exercise with long notes, okay? Don't just lo do long notes because you have to do them. Actually, actively think about something, okay? And you can do this window exercise both with the whole saxophone and with the neck as well, okay? Because doing it with both will actually help a lot. Hey guys, my name is Martino. She no, 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 cambiaron, no, cambiaron. Hello guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Martino, she is Leonora, and we welcome you to this channel. We are... Hello guys, my name is Martino, she is Leonora, and we welcome you to this London Saxophone School channel. Hello guys, my name is...